Hey crafters, I'm Alexa, and in the next few minutes, we'll go over what each smart folder's function is by following a document's journey as it moves through each of our smart folders. The smart folders I'm referring to are here on the left sidebar and they start with organize all the way down to publish content. Each of these are our smart folders and they have different filters and functionalities for how they sort through your documents. If you don't see these smart folders listed here, chances are you simply just have to customize your sidebar and they'll pop up for you accordingly. Now I've already created my document here titled Journey of a Document just for content purposes and we'll go ahead and follow this document's journey through each of these smart folders. So in our organized smart folder, which is where we currently are, as you can see, it's quite similar here to the list of folders on our left sidebar. So each of our folders here are listed, including any documents that have not been organized into a specific folder yet. Basically, our organized smart folder gives you a high level overview of all of your content within this space. Similarly, our all docs smart folder lists every single document that exists within this current space. So whereas in the organized smart folder, we saw all the folders, their titles, and the amount of items or documents nesting within each one, our all docs smart folder simply take away the folder icon and it shows you each of our documents. I can change the view as well in case that makes it easier for you to sort through your documents, but I personally like this view. Now let's go to our document and from here I'm going to star this document. So by right clicking I can star it and you'll see that little gold star popping up in the top corner and when we navigate into our starred smart folder my document will be here. Now since before I mentioned that this current document is not sorted into any specific folder. It's just floating loosely throughout my craft space. So it will also be found in our unsorted smart folder. Any documents you create that you have yet to organize can be located here in your unsorted smart folder. And from here, let's make this a template as well. So you can simply drag and drop this into your My Templates. And the best part about this is that once it's listed here in your My Templates smart folder, you can also select the templates button up here. And not only do you have every template to choose from that craft has to offer, but you will also see any personally customized templates you've created right up top. So from here, let's go ahead and edit this template. Let's share this document. We'll create it as a published web link. So when I navigate into my published content smart folder, my document will be there. So as you can see, it's currently shared and ready to go for some viewers and readers. We just don't have any yet, so there's no data populated. But once you do have readers and viewers and time spent with the shared document, you'll have data populated here in this white graph section. The only smart folder left to cover is our calendar smart folder. So navigating into our calendar smart folder, it'll bring up today's date right away. A lot of people use our calendar smart folder or otherwise known as our daily notes section. Um, some people use it as a diary. Other people use it as uh, random notes, uh, work summaries after their work day. We here at Craft use daily notes every single day to summarize what we've discovered throughout our work day um, and any wins and achievements, things like that. So it's a great way to just keep track of your day-to-day -day work. And if you swipe to the left, you'll see the calendar view as well with the, the full calendar dates here. And you can create future daily notes. You can add some to the past. It's up to you completely. And if you swipe back, you'll be right back to your folder view. So I'm going to link our document. Wonderful. And I'm going to add a microphone emoji. So now we have my daily note. At this point, we've covered each of our smart folders. I hope that was helpful and happy crafting.